In this video, I want to quickly summarize what we've learned about the API routes feature in Next.js. We started off by understanding that API routing mechanism is similar to page-based routing mechanism. We learned that APIs are associated with a route based on their file name. Every API route exports a default function typically named as handler function. The handler function receives the request and response as parameters. We then saw how to cater to different request types like get and post using request.method. We also learned about dynamic API routes, catch-all API routes, and also how to handle a delete request. Finally, we learned that we should not call our own API routes for pre-rendering content as it just induces a delay. Hopefully, you're now in a position to build full-stack production-ready applications with Next.js. With that, we come to the end of the API routes section of this series. We have now covered the three core pillars of Next.js, routing, pre-rendering, and API routes. But we are not quite done. There are still small but important sections we need to learn about. So starting next video, let's take a look at styling in Next.js. Thank you all for watching. Please do subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next video.